Hello guys and welcome to another one of my Hearthstone videos here. I feel a little stuck at this uh, few stars here in rank 9. Um, I've been winning one, losing one, winning one, losing one, and it's been really annoying. Um, ah, warriors. Uh, rogues, priests. Uh, uh, uh. I won to the priest, lost to a warrior. Now I'm up against the rogue. Without really having the kind of uh, start that I was hoping for here. It's gonna be a slow build up and it's... Like, I mean, I think the last 15, 20 rogues I've been playing against... Uh, Tinker's or uh, get rid of it. Uh. Yeah, okay, let me fall asleep. Um, it's super effective. I can see that why it's super fun to play. Um, it's really boring to play against. Not that... It's not like that deck has been particularly effective against uh, against what I've been playing. I've been probably... I want to say 60-40 win radio to me, but uh, maybe... 50-50. Uh, <clears throat> because they're so relying on their sprint, it's crazy. And having counter spell, I've been able to really be lucky with it quite a few times. Um, so let's see if we can get the first of the blade flurries out of the way. Would be nice. Probably gonna see a Violet Teacher. Oh, a dragon. That was cool. Well, it's gonna die. Because that is what dragons do best. So, I haven't really seen that in the deck before. So, I could be up against something new, that would be cool. I really want to get my mirror down, um, I wonder. but I'm probably gonna go Zero Drake. That the Zero Drake needs to die. I really hope my opponent isn't gonna go prep and flurry before I at least get a chance to take it out. Good, 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 good. Um, The spell damage is like the most dangerous thing in that deck because it really adds to, to the weapon poison damage that gets blurried. Sap? No. Oh. That was pretty cool. That was very nice for me. Very bad for my opponent, I think. Um, so let's get this down. See if we can turn the tides of the battle. I'm expecting to see a sap. But it could be also this rates. I don't picture any scenario where it's allowed to live. I think that would be amazing. Yeah, then it is. But. <sighs> okay. Wow. So it smells like Blade Flurry, of course. Um, but I need to do this. I mean, if I see Tingo's 
I needed to hit the. Uh, I need really needed to hit the Senjin. Now I can be very lucky to see. Wow. <laughs> it's a gang up deck. I did not see that coming. How absolutely amazing. And here I am with all my card draws. Wow, that was so cool. Let's keep it at that. So I have room to draw a fireball. That's really what I'm waiting for. So I'm gonna burn one card now. That's okay. So let's see. All that one down. That one down. Bum, 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 bum. That one down. That one. This one. Good times. That was really fun to see gang up Murloc in a deck like this. I was so not expecting it. It's a little risky against the mage, I'd say. But okay. So, do I want the additional. Do I want to go with this? Yeah, let's just do it. So, let us go with that. And go with that. Seven. I'm thinking of popping down the acolyte. I'm gonna do that. Just in case I see Murlocs like crazy, and it's nice not to burn too much. But then I'm worried. I mean, <clears throat> I wonder. unless my opponent has like sh sprint on hand, and we can go crazy pants. It's, it looks like a win. Was a sprint on hand? No. Wow. Death does not scare me. Yep, yeah, so that was a game one. Gonna pop my Azure Drake. No, I'm not. Alrighty then. I was actually expecting to lose this game because my streak has been going well. But um, that was kind of cool. Now I just need to not run into another warrior. That would be. But at least, to be honest, for a while I haven't been losing to paladins. Uh, that's kind of cool. Thank you guys very much for watching.